1500 1500 la pareja, es una pareja hembra macho Agapornis se reproducen en cautiverio 99, 94, 25, 42. Hola, ¿cómo estás? Sal I'm uh, looking uh, for you. <laughs> Saludos, mucho gusto. get them so you can have a chicken in your home and get free eggs. so good looks so good <laughs> oh man so good hey guys how's it going and welcome back to another episode in today's episode we're gonna go to the tianguis we're gonna go to the flea market all right i'm here with christian and uh you want to say hi hey 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 and uh you know we're just uh here on a sunday morning um enjoying the tianguis in fact let me put the camera forward and uh just uh start filming and showing you what's up now today's episode i'm gonna be just uh filming maybe narrating a little bit but just showing you um what this is all about now this is like the biggest and the best flea market in all of merida all right so you know i'm gonna do some narrative narrating and some no narrating but basically just showing you around, you know, all the cool stuff that they have here. There's a bunch of nuts and bolts, bolts. Look at that, cool stuff. Might need one of these. Look at that, I can find the good camera. Oh yeah, yeah. I'm gonna go check that out in a second. Something's I feel comfortable buying here. Other things, probably not so much. But look at that. There's a bunch of. Look at that. Yeah. <laughs> In case you need a phone battery. Bruh. All right, so I'm just gonna cut it here. We're gonna be doing various cuts throughout, you know, today's episode as I show you around this humongous, ginormous flea market. Thank <laughs> you. 
So I'm walking around uh, while Christian is also walking around. Uh, she's out here mainly in a lot of these uh, stores looking for clothes. As you guys can see, you can get clothes. Again, kind of like a thrift shop, you know. Uh, again, it's a flea market, all that good stuff, you know. A uh, secondhand store. And look, you can get things for 50 cents, basically. Um, 50 cents. 50 cents, you know, US. Okay, these are US. And, um, you know, sometimes a dollar and all that good stuff. Look at that. You can get four for five dollars. Wow. It's interesting. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> what a reception. <laughs> and that's another reason I love it out here so much. Everybody always has a sense of humor. For the most part, everybody's always in a great mood for the most part and everybody's just always jolly no matter what um so yeah all right so hope you guys are enjoying uh, our little walk um not quite sure how we're gonna be you know editing this later you know we'll always figure it out i know it's usually you know a good uh which might call it a product at the end of the day all right so let's uh let's keep walking around and hopefully we can uh find christian i'm sure she's out here somewhere I got a GPS track around her, so Bruh. we're good. <laughs> Pornis 
You never know what you're going to find at the flea market. Oh wow, I remember these. I used to collect these. Wow, I used to collect these back like over 20 years ago. I think this is from the 90s, I'm pretty sure. Look at that. That's crazy. Cool. I wonder what they're worth now. Probably not much of it being sold here. Look at that. Yeah. The greatest. The GOAT. I always love seeing all the cool little toys and collectibles that they have all over the place. Check these guys out. I remember having all of these. Hola. Buenos días. Buenos días. I kind of might want to buy one. I mean, I know they're all over the flea market, so I might end up leaving with at least one so I can take back home with me. So, anyways, all right. Onward. Onward. So we got, look, homemade cheese and honey. Well, look, the uh, famous uh, Yucatecan cheese. More of it here. Okay. More uh, Yucatecan delicacies. But yeah, there's a very famous cheese out here. Uh, butter cookies. You know, that's uh, basically it's just sewing material in here. It's not cookies, just sewing material. <laughs> Ooh, plants. Mm -hmm. Look at these species. I guess you take them in a cup. Are you drinking? Or? So put these fish in a cup though. <laughs> Oh look, all kinds of spices. I knew I was smelling something. We got pumpkin seeds, oregano. Oh, 
I think I'm gonna get some of these. I can't find red beans anywhere. All right, I got my red beans. Hell yeah. All right. Can make some red beans. The musical fruit. Well, all beans are musical fruit. Look at that. You want some juice? All right, let me put this away and we'll get back to recording in a second. One thing <laughs> that a lot of you guys are gonna have to realize is that uh, you're gonna be a lot taller than a lot of things out here. You're gonna be hitting your head a lot if you're not careful, like me. But anyways, just keep uh, walking around and looking around, all right, and see what we got. But yeah, it's uh, at least for me, it's kind of it's kind of hard to find anything in my size. Um, but you know, depending on who you are and what your size is, will depend on whether you're gonna find something or not. Right, let's uh, go this way. I feel like we're going in circles. We're not. We're going in an eight. And like, was it like an eight? So we're now on the periphery, on the outside of the of the whole thing. The thing is, it's like so many people show up here. This has been here for such a long time. It just keeps growing and growing and growing and growing. And so therefore, um, you know, it spills out to the outside. As you guys can see, we're on the street already here. And, you know, still people selling all kinds of things. So 
all the way at the end now you might not be able to really see it but all the way at the end over there that huge wall you're gonna see at the end that's uh the prison i don't know if it's a former prison or a current prison but we're right next to it so we're in the south by the way a lot of you guys don't know where we are we're in the south and uh that's where we are all right so anyways let's uh take a look at what we got over here look at that we're selling all kinds of chemicals to clean cleaning chemicals we got radios over here more plants more plants oh. Furniture, if you want to get some furniture made out here. Hold on, hold on. More plants. Honestly, I honestly have no idea where we parked, but we dropped like a pin, you know, a little, a little word of advice, you know, uh, with a WhatsApp or with whatever, you know, Google thing that you got, you can, uh, you know, just simply drop a pin and you'll know where your car is when you get back, once you're done, because, you know, it's a lot to take in, you know, meaning it's, uh, you know, for the average person, I've already been here a few times. Um, I made a video here before. I'll link that video um, at the end of this one. I came here like before, the pandemic so i came out here three years ago and um yeah we haven't been back since so you know it's good to and by the way it's good to see it's, it's good to see that as you see in the south in the southern portion you know of uh, everything that we're doing out here um hold on. <laughs> um you know in the south what i was saying yeah sorry i was saying i was saying hi to the guy <laughs> I don't even know where the f I am now. I gotta figure it out. Oh yeah, there it is. I know. There's this way. But as I was saying, um, it's good to see everybody, most people in the South, not wearing a mask. So again, I know. Moot point. Oh, let's see what they got over here. <laughs> so like he's selling tepache, you know, which is uh, the alcohol drink made out of pineapple. <laughs> see. <laughs> The guy was saying in the background is like, yeah, man, it's good to get really nice and drunk. And you guys know, I, on the cooking show, I've made that. Um, so I've made tepache. It's just uh, easy to make and yummy to make. And just keep, uh, keep on keeping on. Oh, this guy's shopping there too. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> 
disperati. y al celular 99 91 43 76 92 sin compromiso ¿Qué precio tiene la sesión? ¿35 o 3%? Gracias 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 Gracias
This used to be um, a lot more full, a um, lot more stalls. I think, I think this area here used to sell meat. Um, oh no, the meat section's over there. I don't know why this section's empty. Um, this was not empty before. I guess it's, you know, um, the market's still recovering slowly but surely. Um, so yeah, that's the situation. It's pretty empty. Um, half of it is uh, full, the other half is empty. I'm coming this way because I need to show you something. Look at this, another cute doggy. So many cute doggies here. Oh, another cute doggy over there. We're gonna see him in a second, but look at that. Very religious out here, as you know. We have another cute doggy doing cute doggy things. 
He said, give me food. Look at this. Oh, of course all the dogs are here. Of course, oh, he's, oh, he's camera shy. But I think, yeah, no wonder all the dogs are here. This is uh, the food section here. So. So we got food section, but yeah, I mean, this area used to be a lot more full. We're just gonna keep walking through here. Give you a little tour of the inside. Um, I guess these areas inside are like more paid stalls. As you saw outside, on the outside part of the section, you know, the outside part of the flea market, um, you know, it, it, there's some empty spots, you know, not all spots were taken. You could, you know, pay for a spot or not pay for a spot. Oh, I'm getting a phone call. One second. They're gonna get the pet aquí? Sí. Nah, donde? Yeah. I'm, I'm looking for Christian. Está sentada, donde está? Oh, I see her. All right, so Christian's all the way out there. So I'm talking to her right now. That's who was calling. All right, so give me a sec. We're, we're gonna go catch up with her. <laughs> <laughs> all right have a fun uh, have a fun have fun exploring out there all right i'm gonna keep exploring so i can keep making this video and she's gonna keep uh you know flea marketing because uh they love it out here i'm sure you guys love it too that's why we're making this video so all right bye have fun see you later we'll catch up in a little bit all right let's get back to uh to the tour all right hold on we didn't finish the powwow give me one second <laughs> All right, so we just finished our little powwow. She just needed a few more pesos, right? So they can buy more clothes. So she's out there thrifting away and, uh, you know, having fun, right? Looking for clothes, looking for stuff. I already, look at this here. She filmed, filmed, and filmed my bag. Can you see it? This is all stuff that she bought. Because <laughs> you already saw only bought the beans. Anyways, all right. Yeah, so she's going to go back to shopping, and that's it. I'm out of here. All right, bye, bye. All right, and I'm going to finish doing what I got to do here all right so let's get back to it <laughs> so look at this all right we got the raw chicken just hanging there it's all good so a lot of these yeah sorry I dropped something there but anyways um all these chickens you know were killed uh, today in the morning and they're just hanging there um I wouldn't necessarily buy one of these and eat one of these, um, but I have, um, and I've been fine. So just FYI, the only reason is only because it's so hot out here. Um, in any other part of Mexico, it's like really cold, so it's okay. I, I hope you understand what I mean. You know what I mean? You want to keep this stuff away from flies and uh, in cold weather. But regardless, I've eaten it because I've had to because I live here and I go to families' houses and and I and I, you know, I go to the villages and all that stuff and I eat it and everything is fine nothing happens so just fyi but you know maybe your stomach might not be able to handle it so let's just keep it real all right all right then we have uh, we got food over here here let me show you the food over here she's making <laughs> Everybody's very, uh, hola. <laughs> no camera shyness here. So, anyways, yeah, they're just making some cr uh, traditional Yucatecan food here. Um, Christian was also asking me if I'm hungry yet so we can eat all that good stuff. So, hola. <laughs> and, <laughs> and, um, yeah, okay, so here they got meat. Oh, here they got meat, meat, you know, uh, actual ground meat, all right? All right, I gotta go around. All right, so I'm gonna go around, all right? Maybe he's just cutting up some beef, all right? These guys are just taking a break, you know? But see, I recognize these guys. I don't know if I'm gonna, you know what? Maybe I can find it in the, I don't know if I have, I, I filmed it the last time. I'm pretty sure I did, but I remember coming here. I remember these guys. Hola, como estas? Sal I'm uh, looking uh, for you. <laughs> Saludos, mucho gusto. I'm here, sir, I'm here. Where are you from? 
Eh, de Miami, cubano. Miami. Sí, 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 habla español también. Ya, 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 no me que haciendo los videitos. Ya. So yeah, again, super friendly. Yeah, I remember again the last time I was here years ago. This this was so much busier, so many more people. Um, and um, but yeah, these guys are still around, so that's that's good to know. And um, see, with beef, you know, I don't really. There's not really much of a problem with beef. You know, just leaving it there um, because as you know, you're, they're aging it or what have you. So it's just you know going to make it taste better. But. You know, it's up to you guys. I mean, I'm not talking about too much of the food safety issue thing, but I'm sure a lot of you guys are thinking the same and wondering the same. But, you know, at the end of the day, you know, if you're going to see some even vegetables or, or fruits that might not be, you know, that good, you know, um, if you see some fruits or vegetables that might not be, you know, up to par, might not be the best. Look at this. Doggy, doggy. So what was I saying again? Yeah, you might find some... Uh, you might find yourself, you know, with some uh, fruits or vegetables that might not be, you know, the, the greatest, you know, um, in condition. And you're going to get discounts on that. And same thing with everything else. And again, sometimes you want extra ripe bananas so you can make the banana bread. You know what I mean? Um, and, and so on and so forth. Or, or bananas that are not so ripe for certain things. So it is what it is. You know what I mean? Uh, out here, people are not that squeamish about some, about some uh, black spots on a banana. Or, you know, a few spots in a tomato or whatever. You know what I mean? Are you kidding me? Just a bigger discount. So again, even more local food here, as you guys can see, a lot of turkey, 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 turkey. They're making little tortas. So they're making torta de cochinita. They have uh, chicken, uh, a lot of turkey again. It's a main, you know, staple out here. And um, if you guys don't know um, too much about uh, empanadas there. So if you guys don't know too much about uh, you know, uh, Yucatecan cuisine, you can just uh, orient yourself a little bit there, but you know, they're making all the Yucatecan fare here. Um, because this is a Yucatecan 1000% market. Everything out here is is that, you know what I mean? So you're gonna you're not gonna find, you know, um, food for the most part from other parts of Mexico here. It's gonna be very rare. Maybe as everything grows and as everything just expands and more people show up here, you know, from other parts of Mexico and uh, they start filling up the empty spots back there and all that good stuff maybe then maybe then we'll, we'll find uh you know some more variety out here um but again it's not like it, the variety is needed you know again we're, we're coming to like the most important the biggest uh um flea market market tianguis you know in all of uh merida so therefore you know we're gonna keep it as authentic and as uh you know local as humanly possible right but you know it, uh, we're not we're also not going to be shying away from any wonderful, wonderful new things that show up here um, that will. And I know they have because I've seen them. All right, anyways, enough of me talking. Let's get back to just showing you around and maybe some narration, maybe not. Because I don't know, I haven't edited this yet. We're filming still, all right? So we're still on the filming part of the, of the show here. So yeah, just, you know, in case you guys aren't aware, you know, making these videos are you know, also a bit more difficult because not only do I have to film, I got to edit and I got to put it all together and, uh, you know, just trying to put the best possible product for you guys that allows you to, in a sense, be here. You know what I mean? It allows you to you know, almost be here, you know? Like, uh, that's the idea behind these videos. Uh, and even when I'm narrating, I'm just talking to you as if you're standing here next to me and we're just walking around um, talking to you. Even though everyone around me is like, this guy's crazy. He's talking to himself. I don't see an earpiece. I don't see anything. Why is he talking to himself? So, you know, the things I got to go through, all right? The things I have to go through. Everybody is always wondering why I'm talking to myself. But I'm not. I'm talking to all of you guys out there. Look at that. A lot of green. But all these are the local stuff, you know what I mean? You know, sour orange, bananas, another type of banana, uh, grapefruit, limes, lemons, limes, whatever. Um, peppers, habaneros, um, more sour oranges, more peppers, squash, local, I mean, local, local pumpkin, local squash, plantains, aguacate, and, uh, you know, onions and, uh, nopales and potatoes. All right. Say, I know my vegetables, man. All right. Let's see, I see some food this way. Let's check out this food. There's, when there's a line, there's always good food. 
Oh, look at that. A lot of uh, chicharrón. So I, I'm guessing, yeah, he's making like little sandwiches with chicharrón. It's just, that's all it is. It's just pork rinds. Gorditas. Sí, gorditas. Okay, gorditas de chicharrón. <laughs> and then that's a chicharrón prensal, which is basically just pressed together chicharrón. Muchas gracias. So all the leftover uh, pork rinds, they put them together, they smash them together, and they make this other thing called, you know, chicharrón. I forgot what it was called. But anyways, but yeah, anyway, so let's keep exploring and checking everything out here. But I mean, the market is pretty much, you know, busy, busy as it used to be busy. Um, as I remember it. I do, I do are, again, this, I, I remember this whole area. I remember. Look at that. I remember having this and it's so delicious. I'm going to be taking some home with me this time. So, hasta que ahora están aquí, hasta las dos. Oh, yeah. I'll be back. Yeah, I'm not going to be, I'm not going to buy it now and carry it with me. I'll be back. I said, this is a food section. Let's just keep looking around all the food. But yes, this used to be so much more full. I would say it's like at 75% capacity. Look at that. It's a huge line but yeah you know um again you know back before the the pandemic situation there used to be so much more action so many more people and nowadays <laughs> I, I got a feeling like some people have already seen me more than once walking around with the camera but anyways but yeah yeah you know it's not still at full capacity but this is good though this is good you know this is a uh, doable capacity you know no, look at that nice shirts <laughs> Man, I might have to pick up a new shirt. I'm, you know, all my other shirts are, you know, on repeat. Look at that. You can also find your smoking accessories here if you, you're looking for those. All right. Looking at all kinds of stuff. So this is this is where this is the Mexican hot topic. Oh, grinders. Hmm. You know what, I'm gonna take a look around here. I'm gonna take a look and then uh, I'm gonna catch up with you guys in a second. We're gonna keep looking around all the food section. All right, so just taking a look around here. I don't wanna bore you with my uh, shopping. Um, I bought the ashtray <laughs> and um, the t-shirts, you know, they don't have my fat size, you know, unfortunately. They only have like a, a few t-shirts in my size and that's something I wanted to buy. So, you know, no t-shirt, but he said there's another, he owns another stall um, down the road. So we're gonna walk down that way while we're taking a little cruise around here all right so you can see uh see what's up okay and hopefully at the other store maybe they got some more shirts in bigger sizes and we'll just take a look around see what we got but yeah i was talking to him just had a little conversation real quick asking a few questions he seems friend he seemed friendly enough and i was just asking him oh i'm going through the back all right gonna go this way really cool man. <laughs> so all right, you know what? Let, let's uh, keep finishing the food section, and then we'll we'll head back that way. All right. I think everyone's just eating through here. It's just a bunch of people eating, and we already saw the food. Let me see. But anyways, I was just asking the guy, having a quick conversation with the guy, and just asking him. Oh, there we go. Get the behind the scenes. I'll finish that thought once we're done here. Look at this guy looking for any scraps. Looks so good, smells so good. We're definitely gonna eat something. Yeah, we just walk through here. I know I shouldn't be walking back here, but look at that. I'm in the kitchen. I should not be in the kitchen. I don't even know how the hell I got here. Alright, I'm gonna get out of here. We we'll walk. Uh, no, yeah, we gotta walk this way. More doggies. All right. So, as I was saying, as the guy was explaining to me, I was asking him, "Hey, so how much?" Well, I didn't ask him how much, but I asked him, "Hey, do people um, have to pay, you know, to be out here, you know, to have their stall, to have their thing?" And they said, "Yes. You know, it's basically depending on where they are. 
whether they're out here or they're on the street all the ones on the street basically anyone that's selling anything out here has to pay something to somebody we already came through here and i got man see bro anyways <laughs> whatever oh, okay good see they, they make it easy to escape they make it easy to move around here but uh but yeah everybody has to pay somebody meaning that they either pay the people of the property here or they have to pay the city or they have to pay they have to pay somebody so anyone that's selling anything no matter where anywhere in the vicinity anywhere period in the story they got to pay something and i'm guessing that in some cases they're just paying they're, they're just paying for uh uh whatchamacallit um sometimes like a just a minor business license or other things like that so we got again the cheese very important cheese out here this is also pretty good cheese but it's like um cheese that would hold up in this kind of weather without refrigeration you follow me all right let's uh let's keep looking this way keep looking around oh that's okay there's the other store thing all right let's go check out that store see what they got all right so let me see if they got any other sizes let me hang out here for a minute okay and then we'll get back to to shopping all right so uh again no size uh, in fact uh, they only had like two and extra large everything else is small or medium and it's really small and really medium even the extra large here is probably not going to fit me i need like a double x you know um even though in the u.s um I, this is like a large you know maybe an extra large you know uh like large extra large pushing it but out here it's like no way i need like a double x it's just everything runs small instead of running big and the things in the u.s things run big but anyways whatever you know i get to talk to them to chill out but yeah as i was saying everybody got to pay something um which is pretty interesting because i figured that some people um you know like especially the ones that were like way out you know like on the street and the ones that were really far away you know the ones that were really far away from the market that i showed you guys a little earlier that they wouldn't have to pay anything so look um the corn thing they're selling that there <laughs> oh there he is he's making them back there <laughs> Oh. so basically it's just corn in a cup with mayonnaise and cream and a bunch of other awesome stuff it's so good so good <laughs> sorry <laughs> my apologies i'm here in the way um but yes yes i mean that's when we go to the parque las americas and we have those because those are the best in town and man they're so good i don't eat them all the time but they're good Again, corn with mayonnaise. I remember when I was a kid, um, I used to have some friends that used to eat corn with mayonnaise and I used to think it was horrible until I tried it and it was so good. And then I come here and, well, everybody eats it with mayonnaise. And it's like, I mean, mayonnaise is just fat. I mean, think about it. So, um, you know, you put butter on it, don't you? They don't put butter on it. They just put mayonnaise and cream. Um, and you would think it doesn't taste good, but it tastes good. Okay, so we're just walking through you know this section of the mall now i mean this section of the flea market all right we got lady hats if you want them we got more food more tortas again very delicious very yummy see this like cochinita okay one of my favorites and it's very 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 traditional to eat this on sunday that is like what you eat on sunday you know you get drunk all weekend and then sunday morning you eat this and you go to church so or not go to church but I'd definitely eat that at least here so get more of that I think uh, I feel like we've been through here I don't know look at that one oh, super nice I feel like we've been through here did we come through here oh yeah we did come through here see I'm so lost all right so let me I don't want to keep uh filming the same thing over and over again so let me uh, reorient myself and get back to the other section that i know we haven't seen yet i don't know how i ended up here <laughs> obviously i'm lost and definitely christian is like nowhere near where i am so let me uh, just uh, reorient and uh, get back on track doggy doggy stuff for him see if gizmo would like all this stuff i would buy him <laughs> mm. 
more doggy stuff. Very tight little spot area here. All right, there we go. <laughs> I'm like, you want some cheese whiz? Oh, they got like full little Lego sets. Are these Legos? No, these aren't even Legos. What is this? Yeah, man, I used to remember when I was growing up as a kid and, you know, I would ask Santa Claus, you know, for uh, some Legos and every once in a while my parents couldn't afford Legos so they would get me like some some off-brand like whatever that is or whatever that is or and and it would never fit and it would never you know it would never fit with uh, the other Legos and I would always be so upset but you know I can see the it's still alive and well those uh, <laughs> going on here. <laughs> hey. All kinds of dogs out here. Oh look, these are cheaper here than Walmart. I wonder if these fell off a truck if you know what I mean. Huh. We got honey. I already we bought honey the other day, so we don't need honey. Let's uh, go this way. So we actually came through that street. We parked like a few blocks down that way. But yeah, parking out here. I remember the first time. <laughs> I remember the first time I came out here, you know, we uh, had the Uber just drop us off, but then we had to park today and holy crap, yeah, um, it was difficult, but we found it, we found it, it was just not difficult, it was easy to find parking, it was just far away, so, but yeah, everybody, even these people are on the street all the way out here, they got to pay something, um, and I asked the guy, does everybody pay something different, and he basically said, no, it just depends on who, where you are, depends on the combination of payments you got to make to certain people so i don't know i mean oh yeah horse 
but regardless, uh, I just thought it was pretty interesting. Oh, there's more food out here. Yum, yum. We got good stuff out here. All right. I think this guy's trying to get out. All right, so let's, uh, nothing much going on out here. Just people doing their thing. <laughs> All right, so let's go through this part. Uh, And I didn't go through here yet. <laughs> so we got a lot of the same down this way. Just trying to see if we can find anything new. I think I see some new stuff down there. Let's just take a walk together, a little gander, see what we can find. I thought, oh, there it is. That's what I saw in the distance. Some cheese. That's interesting there. Just a block of cheese. <laughs> They're looking at me like, why the hell is that guy recording our cheese? Fuck. <laughs> F that guy. Oh, look at that. Get this for Christian. <laughs> we should get that for her. <laughs> got more fish okay so i know we came through this way. let's just keep going this way then <clears throat> see now it's starting to get hot so you know now you know talking you know talking about why the market these that look at these nice pots <laughs> hola <laughs> Wait, she get the she get the jason mask a cuanto cuanto esta 10 pesos. 10 pesos? Sí. Dale, let's, 10 pesos, all right? 50 cents, let's do it. Está bien. Ay, ay, de, mira. Ah, <laughs> Gracias. Gracias. Look at that. Come. All right, hold on. All right, you ready? All right, I just picked a strap in the back. Bruh. <laughs> <laughs> gonna fix the strap but anyways there you go ready for halloween good to go can't beat 50 cents christian will fix the the, the strap yeah right, let me uh there you go better <laughs> all right see see oh no no yeah no okay. te muchas gracias gracias <laughs> We got eggs out here. But you see, look, sometimes that's why flea markets are awesome. Because a lot of times, you know, you really don't want to spend any money. But I mean, who, who can say no to 50 cents? Who can say no to a dollar? You know? See, look, those masks, you know, they they look cool. They look all right, but that, that's going to be suffocating as hell. You know? I can wear the hockey mask, no problem. So, you can do that. Nah, I think we should buy more mint. Oh, look at all the dog chains over there. Look at all the dog stuff. Got yeah, regular chains, dog chains, <laughs> slingshot. You want a slingshot? I should just get this for the hell of it. Man, I want to be smacking myself in the head with a rock, though. I got a feeling that's probably what's going to... I got a feeling I'll buy the slingshot, and I'm just going to end up slingshotting a, a rock to my head. <laughs> Someone understood me. Someone speaks English. <laughs> we got pots. Yeah, so this is a good area here. We got a lot of uh, tools, a lot of uh, these these pots. Yeah, but these are too thin. You know, these are, these are way too thin. I like I like thick. I like thick aluminum. Let me see. Nah, still thin. 
Ja, ja, ja. See, you got tire irons, you got, you know, levels, hammers, all kinds of shit. Giant fork, so I can eat. <laughs> Alright, let's see, let's see, where are we going now? Uh, let's just keep going this way. <laughs> Look at that. You got the kids out here playing while the while the parents are sh sh shopping or selling. <laughs> All right, guys. Sorry about that. You know the camera died there last minute. Uh, Bruh. All right, so the camera died there. And sometimes it may be good, sometimes it may be shit. All right, so the camera died as I was uh, filming here. Um, got overheated. It's getting nice and hot and toasty out here. Um, I'm gonna take a little break. Let's get back into showing you around. We got all kinds of little things here, little animals. Some kinds of little toys. More more uh, Legos from another planet. I guess this is the, the rough part of the the rough area of the look at these guys here. The rough area of the whatchamacallit of the flea market. Oh that's nice. Need any random cables? I should come out here with all my thousands of cables to try to sell my cables. But this is the place to come, though. If you ever need, like, uh, look, more, more little animals, more little chicks. Yeah, let's go check these guys out. No, no, that's. these guys so now you know where to get them so you can have a chicken in your home and get free eggs you know? A lot of animals at the flea market. That's always a thing, right? I don't know about where you are, but at least uh, back in Miami, we, we, we there's always animals, all kinds of animals. We got all kinds of phones. In case you need a phone. Camcorder. You want a camcorder? I don't even know how you would even put video film from that on a on a modern uh, a modern computer these days anyway. Probably take a lot of work. More tools, more levels, more stuff this way. Let's go this way for a minute. <clears throat> Gotta be careful where I'm walking. There's a lot of uh, a lot of holes and stuff around here. I anyway, know you don't care. Anyways. Vamos, amor. 
Vamos, ya se fue mamá, te vas a quedar en el Just like it. So crazy. ¿A cuánto vende ese? En 500, ok. Gracias. It can be all mine for 25 bucks. Yeah, that VCR back there I was showing you guys. I know there was a lot of music, so. Um, but yeah, that VCR was uh, 25 bucks. I kind of want to buy it, but it's just junk at this point. So why would I buy it? But that's the same VCR that we had um, when I was growing up when I was a little kid in the 80s. My dad bought that, I remember. Look at that computer. <laughs> it's all torn apart. We're just hanging out on the outside here. I don't want to hit my head with this. <laughs> Look how much taller I am. <laughs> Among us. Among us. <laughs> I love how all the people always laughing at my ass, you know? Makes it a lot easier to film when everybody's just laughing and having a good time and, you know. So, yeah. It just keeps going on and on and on and on everybody playing all kinds of different music i might not get a copyright strike because there's like five different songs playing at the same time but yeah look let's just go out to that corner might as well oh sorry some people don't want to be recorded <laughs> Oh shit, look at that. Look at those ribs, chicken, all kinds of stuff. <laughs> what a rico. Look at that. Oh man, that looks so good. It smells so good. It looks so good. <laughs> oh man. so good it smells so good i might i might uh we might have uh lunch out here all right 
We just keep walking. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> the cop was just was like, hey, I, don't I know you? I've already seen you like five times walking around here. <laughs> Sorry, hey, gracias. So, look at that. Oh, look. Buy, I should buy myself an award. What do you think? What do you think? I should get myself an award, right? What do you think, huh? Walking through very tight quarters here. Nice, nice and quiet on this uh, end over here. This section is quiet. You need some metal work. You need a fan, blade. Sorry, I was looking, uh, getting distracted. Look at that. Oh, is that real? Yeah, that's a nice little decoration. A little antique. <laughs> Oye, ¿a cuánto? Um, $2.50, okay. Thank you. Gracias. <laughs> you got rocks. Parrot stuff. Hola. Oh, look, one of these old ass projectors. Wow. We got CDs, books. No, look, and more uh, older antique things out here. Yeah, I'm always looking through always the, all the coins. I don't see anything really here, uh, but I'm, I always look through all the coins. You never know what you can find. I found some gems. Hold on. <laughs> I found some real silver out here before. Um, or in areas like this, you know, they, they just have real silver out and uh, they sell it, you know, but I, I know there's nothing there. Remote controls. Wow. In case you want to add a DVD drive right to your, to your computer, to your disk drive. I haven't seen one of those in a while. 100% it doesn't even work. Do, 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 do. Yeah, Christian must uh, definitely be having fun out there. I haven't heard from her. <laughs> uh, oh, uh, she's tiny. <laughs> More juice, food. There's just more stuff out there. This seems a little bit more interesting over here. Look at that. These guys have their own little uh, little cubby hole. Look at these bongos. A cuánto ya? Dos mil. Dos mil cada uno. No, no, no. Por la dos. Okay. For a hundred bucks for both. Yeah, they're good. They need work. You know, uh, you know, they gotta work on the drum. It's nice, it's uh, all dry and stuff like that. I'm Cuban, don't ask how I know all those things. Yeah, more cables, more things. Let's see, I don't know. Oh, look, another dog! Another one of these guys, they're everywhere. I know you guys care about the dog, right? I care about the dog, all right? So, oh, what's going on over here? Everybody's, uh, Oh, cool. 
Oh, they're playing that lottery game. That Mexican lottery. That's cool. Oh, that's pretty cool. I'm guessing that's why all the cops are hanging around there. This is a gambling, you know? So, gonna make sure uh, the poor old man uh, keeps his money. <clears throat> look at that. Oh, look. Wow, 350 for that table. Not bad. Hmm. I might come back. I, I know where this area is. It's on the outskirts. So, maybe I'll come back later once I find Christian and we get the car. And I'm not gonna carry that around me now. <laughs> I don't even know what we've seen or what we haven't seen. But I feel like everything oh yeah, everything so far is new, right? I don't think we've really repeated anything. But yeah, we're just getting lost out here. And the nether regions you know we're deep deep <laughs> we're super deep into the in the market right now like i said I, i'm i kind of know where i am but i am pretty lost and so yeah people are already starting to clean up and take things down and get out of here even though it's pretty early um not pretty early it's um it's around 12 30 but people leave around one o'clock 2 p.m. So 1 o'clock, 2 p.m. things close down. But look, all these uh, wooden, you know, key hangers and all kinds of holders. Yeah, we definitely haven't come through here. I haven't seen any of that. Oh, look, that's nice. 750 for that, though. No oh, pool. Like, like, look at that. Right next to the hustler. That's funny. Right next to the Bible. We got the Bible. <laughs> we got the <laughs> was it that hustler? I'm sure it has to be. Bruh. <laughs> <In> the... <laughs> Good stuff. Right. Sorry. Let's see if we can get through here. Ellie Cooper. Tight squeeze. All right. Oh, hey, look where we are. We're on the other end of the. Remember, we lost connection at some point all the way over there. We run around, I don't know, all through all this here. So. Cassettes? Just walking through here. All right, so we're just trying to figure out where to go next here. It's giving you a tour of everything here. I'm trying to show you as much of the market as I can. I think I've shown you all the market or most of the market. I'm sure I'm missing a few spots here and there. But look, see, this is like the little park where the kids can do stuff. So, you know, there's a lot of activities for the kids as well so that the kids can go and be on their own and do things. And again, it's not that um, concern out here like in other countries that, you know, the kids are not going to be safe or what have you. Um, it's not like that at all. All right, I know we came through here already. So, all right, I'm going to see if I can uh, gather where I am. What is it? Re uh, gather my bearings again? I don't even know. I can't even speak straight. But I gotta figure out where I am and uh, gotta figure out where to go next and then I'm gonna film some more because again I already know kind of where I am and I don't want to um, film, uh, I don't want to repeat the same thing over and over again. All right, anyways, let's uh, look at that. The kid's about to go on the slide. So we'll just leave it, we'll leave it with that. All right, and I'll see you at the next scene. Let's go. <laughs> I found her. She was already eating. She couldn't wait for me. Actually, it's a good thing she did that because, you know, all the food ran out. The cooks are already eating and there's nothing left. As I was walking over here trying to find her, um, 
all the food, all the food stalls were already done. You know, there's no more food left. So anyways, it is what it is. I guess I'm just gonna have to order a pizza while I watch football later on tonight. So all good. <laughs> She's like, I earned a pizza. I'm tired. <laughs> but anyway, all right, guys, we're gonna. I already filmed an ending. I'm just gonna prompt you to that, and uh, that's it. You know, we're gonna end it here. So it's been a long day. Very tired. Had a lot of fun. I got a bag full of goodies, and uh, yeah. All right. So let me show you to the ending, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. All right, guys. Well, I got lost looking for Christian. Um, I got lost because I was shopping around looking for other stuff, uh, which I did find. Uh, but again, you know, I, I, instead of filming, I was just shopping and looking around and doing all that good stuff. So I got a little distracted and uh, well, here we are. The market's already closing up, as you guys can see. Um, things are already starting to get picked up and ready to go. And uh, I'm actually on my way to go get Christian right now because we're gonna go pick her up. And then I gotta go to another one of these stalls because I'm probably gonna buy a table. And I got a table for a really good deal, a nice big wooden table for uh, 25 bucks. So hopefully the guy will still be there by the time that we're done here. He said he would be, but I gotta hurry. And therefore, gotta hurry up and uh, finish this video. All right, I think we've been filming. All right, as I was saying before, I was really interrupted by uh, the battery running out on this thing. <laughs> um, but yeah, I was just filming the ending. I don't know if you've already seen me and Christian eat or me and Christian do something earlier. I don't know what I'm gonna have time to film after this or not. I'm just filming the ending now because that's, you know, a little, magic a little editing magic that's how we do it um i gotta film the ending you know somewhere in the middle somewhere while we're doing this so that way um when i do run out of battery i can do this all right anyways if you enjoy this kind of content if this content or any content on my channel has ever been any use to you and um it's brought value to you and it's helped you out in any way and you want to help me out in any way well you already know what to do you can send a dollar send five bucks send whatever so that way i can come out here and uh i don't know shop <laughs> and do some stuff as you guys can see i can get a lot for even 50 cents um but with that being said if you can't afford that don't worry about it you know leave a like subscribe share you know do all the good stuff that we normally do out here all right you know on the youtubes and uh you already know what to do guys if you like this kind of content don't forget to please like please subscribe please share please hit the bell icon but more importantly than anything else please stay awesome all right guys you already know what to do thanks again for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one i gotta i gotta go find the wifey uh she sent me some pictures of where she's at and uh i gotta locate her so wish me luck see you guys on the next one thanks for watching bye